encourage your kids to discover their passions in life? My name is Steve Riefman. I'm a National Board Certified Elementary School teacher and author in Santa Monica, California. A couple years ago, I had my students complete a passion survey on the first day of school, and it quickly became one of my very favorite activities to do in the classroom. On this piece of paper, the kids simply listed their four or five very favorite things to do, and then they drew themselves doing it. At the end of the day, I took all the papers home and created a chart, which I placed on the closet door in the back of the room. The chart showed all the kids' names and all the passions and indicated which kids were passionate about which topics. Once the kids saw the passion survey chart on the closet door, three wonderful things happened. First, there was a tremendous bonding effect. So when kids discovered areas of common interest, they either started new friendships with classmates or friendships that they might have already had deepened. Second, when the kids made choices about what they were studying in class, they used the ideas on the passion survey to give them ideas. So for example, if we need to do a nonfiction report in writing, and I don't know what to write about, I could think about what I did on my passion survey, and I could use one of those ideas. So if I'm passionate about baseball, which I am, I could do my project about baseball. The third great outcome was that simply by talking about passions, it became cool to be passionate about things. So for those kids who have not yet discovered their passions, they got to see other people talking about their passions, and it encouraged them to discover their own passions. So, I strongly suggest that at home you discuss with your kids, or even have them write down and draw like I had my students do, what they are most passionate about, and then you can refer to those ideas throughout the year anytime they need to make um, a curricular choice. For more teaching tips, blog posts, and other resources on teaching the whole child, please visit steveriefman.com. Thank mm -hmm. you.